Chris Christie was floored after Donald Trump quoted Russian President Vladimir Putin and also spoke poorly of immigrants during his New Hampshire rally, which took place on Saturday, December 16. He's becoming crazier. And now he's citing Vladimir Putin as a character witness, a guy who was a murderous thug all around the world. Christie, 61, who was also running for president in the 2024 election, told CNN in an interview. He's disgusting, Christie continued, noting that the former president, 77, gets worse and worse by the day. And what he's doing is dog whistling to Americans who feel absolutely under stress and strain from the economy and from the conflicts around the world. Christie also lashed out against members of Congress who have not spoken poorly of the politician as he attempts to take over the White House for the second team. You're telling me that someone who says that immigrants are poisoning the blood of this country, someone who says Vladimir Putin is a character witness, is fit to be president of the United States, was the right president at the right time? Nikki Haley should be ashamed of herself, Christie said, referring to when Haley said Trump is still fit to be president. As OK previously reported, Trump, whose wife, Melania Trump, is an immigrant, went on a rant about people migrating to the United States. They're poisoning the blood of our country. That's what they've done, Donald told the cheering crowd. They poison mental institutions and prisons all over the world, not just in South America, but all over the world. They're coming into our country from Africa, from Asia, all over the world, the former president added. After the comments went viral, people compared Donald to Nazi leader Adolf Hitler. At his rally in NH Today, Trump praised dictators Kim and Xi again for their ability to ruthlessly control their countries and has now made Hitler's poisoning, the blood of our country rhetoric a standard feature of his rally speeches, one person pointed out, while another said, this trend is very disturbing considering the unrest in this country and abroad. The Nga movement is very upsetting to witness. It's impossible to understand why these people prepared to exchange democracy for voting for Trump, another person added, while a fourth said, the normalization of Trump's hateful rhetoric is frightening. This is hardly the first time Donald has been called out for his leadership tactics, as Chris previously stated, the reason is that he acts like someone who doesn't care about our democracy. He acts like someone who wants to be a dictator. He acts like someone who doesn't care for the Constitution.